Hey guys, today I will be showing you how to flash talk, uh, how to flash uh, Cyanogen mode 12.1 on your uh, Euphoria stock. So as you can see, it's completely stock. It's completely stock Android feel. So there is no Cyanogen mode over here. So you just have to go to About Phone, press seven to eight times the build number. You will be enabled uh, the developer option. Yes. So you just have to press this allow OEM and locking just press enable and, uh, connect your uh, euphoria to uh, the PC and you just have to do this thing as you can see USB debugging enable it uh, so this is the main thing guys you should uh, this should appear on your device so always allow from this computer and press ok and uh, that's all as you can see there are uh, four files the PDA net is for drivers so if you if you don't have a driver so you just have to double click them and install them and uh, you should also be having fast boot drivers uh, so each and everything I will be providing in the description below so copy this uh, three files or all the files whichever uh, you need I just need uh, the three files this is uh, the recovery file this is the root file and this is the uh, CM 12.1 official ROM so go into uh, paste them paste the all three all three of them uh, into the internal storage for a betterment don't uh, keep them on uh, the external storage so the copy has been done guys so as you can see there are three files present over here so uh, we just have to open this minimal uh, fast boot drivers so the next thing would be uh, you have to type a command that is uh, Uh, yes, you have to type a command that is uh, adb devices. So just press always allow, and as you can see, our uh, list of device attached is offline. We'll test, uh, as you can see, you have tested once again, and uh, your device has been appearing over here. So we will do this thing adb reboot bootloader just hit enter so as you can see the your uh, UU Fourier has been booted up into the fast mode the next thing would be uh, yes uh, the next thing would be uh, you have to take this com take this command that is uh, fast boot xi I will provide this command uh, into the comment section so just copy it paste it by control V just hit enter you should see your device there and uh, hit the same thing over here and uh, open type boot and uh, okay as uh, you can see uh, there is TWRP mentioned over here you just have to copy it this shortcut over here go to properties for the shortcut thing copy this that is uh, the target and paste it over here and that's enter and uh, in few seconds you should be uh, booted up into the TWRP that shouldn't take a while so don't, uh, don't worry if it takes a while So as you can see team in uh, TWRP has been successfully booted up so go to wipe advanced wipe dalvik cache system data cache so you should choose uh, the four thing as you can see a uh, dalvik cache system data and cache so just flash it so after flashing it uh, you won't be uh, getting this stock android anymore so this might take few uh, few minutes it usually takes few minutes to wipe it so as you can see wipe has been uh, successfully completed it took me about about uh, two to three minutes so be patient guys it will take some time so go back install go down and uh, as you can see here cm 12.1 so just tap it this swipe 
so this will also take about two to three minutes so don't worry and guys uh, if you want any G apps uh, Google Apps packages you can uh, download them put it into the internal file and flash them after uh, flashing this so there's no issue I just uh, don't want it to download uh, the gapps file so I didn't download that if you want you can easily download from uh, the link given in the description below you can easily download them and flash it off so go home install and as you can see here there is uh, another uh, flash that is update uh, super su this is the root file guys if you want to root your device you can uh, root it now itself just swipe it and then just reboot your system you are uh, successfully installed uh, the all uh, the all Cyanogen mod uh, 12.1 so as you can see the booting animation of uh, the Cyanogen you can remove your uh, USB cable there's no issue in that so guys as you can see Android is starting optimizing app 8 of uh, 88 so if you have installed uh, any kind of Google app so that might be about 120 so don't worry if uh, the amount of uh, the optimizing app is a uh, little more so this might take about uh, 2 to 3 minutes be patience so as you can see finishing boot so android is starting finishing boot so as you can see cyanogen mode welcome so next we'll be connecting to any of the Wi-Fi networks right now so right now I don't have any sim so uh, the con uh, the time has been not been updated by the sim network providers so I just press start so as you can see welcome successfully we have booted into the CM 12.1 So as you can see, Cyanogen mode, Cyanogen mode. So yes, guys. So that's it. We have uh, successfully booted up into the Cyanogen mode 12.1. So that's that's the tutorial, guys. That's all uh, for this video. So if you like this video, please do um, hit a comment over there. And uh, if you more like this video, please do. Um, subscribe please do hit uh, the thumbs up over there so that uh, this video could get uh, more and more likes so please uh, share this video guys as, as much as you can possible so thank you so much there will be more video coming coming on uh, euphoria subscribe stay tuned hope you see in my next video thank you so much